Hello YouTube. Geezer here. Yeah, look at that setting behind me. Yes indeed, we're outside. I wanted to make this little video about something I acquired some time back. And uh, I was going to do a video about it a long time ago, but, uh, you know, things just didn't work out that way. So I'm doing it today. And uh, let me show you this. This is the uh, Tool Shop 2 gallon air compressor. Third horsepower, 100 maximum PSI. It's just a little thing, and uh, I don't know if you can tell in the video the box. The box is pretty ratty because I saved it. I saved it all this time, a long time, just so I could use it in this video. It was outside overnight once and got wet, so it looks pretty gnarly. Uh, I got this at Menards about a year and a half ago, I think, and it was. 30 bucks uh, on sale. I don't know what they run now, but they're really not very expensive. And then, of course, not included was the uh, the air hose and the, any fittings. All you get is the air compressor. I think the hose was around 10 bucks, but it was on sale too, so I don't know what it would be now. Let me move some stuff around. I'll be right with you, and I'll show you this little dude. Okay, I'm not showing you this just to show off and say, hey, I've got an air compressor. It was a problem for me from day one with Classy. Uh, with the old tires and with the new ones alike, they bleed off. Uh, I'm sure it's the valve stems. Uh, just to be honest with you, I haven't used this compressor uh, for airing tires since I got it. In fact, I've only used it once and that was to blow out uh, my water lines uh, last fall and it did a good job for that uh, and uh, here in a little bit we're going to find out if it'll do tires too. Just like that. I don't know if you can see that or not, but I like to run these back tires, 65 pounds. Uh, this one right now is showing just shy of 50. So let's hook her up and see what we get. Okay. Here it goes, it's gonna get noisy, so I'm just gonna let it run off camera. Oh, by the way, I already checked with my neighbors on the other side, and they don't think it's gonna bother them, and everybody on the, the side that I'm on have left. So, just something to keep in mind, these little compressors are really obnoxious. I would like to have everybody around me be okay with it before I do it. There we go. Okay, I let that run for a half an hour, and uh, I gained seven pounds in that tire. I didn't need to show you the test on it because it just didn't make it. It's uh, well, right close to 55 pounds, which is the 
for me, the minimum that I'd even drive on. So, uh, I'm going to say it's a fail. Even though I gained a little bit of tire pressure, and I guess in an emergency it would give me something, but pretty disappointed. So we're going to call the, uh, the little Menards uh, air compressor, uh, we're going to give it a uh-uh. But I do want to thank my neighbors for putting up with me, uh, running that little compressor for that long. Uh, they're just nice folks. So anyway, uh, I'm going to drag this one to an end. And uh, So from me and old Lazy Molly just wanted to nap through the whole thing. All the rest of the geezer gangsters. Um, until next time, happy trails.